Hello, what's up guys? Welcome to Digital Creations and in this quick Premiere Pro tutorial, you will learn how to optimize real-time video playback or how to speed up Premiere Pro performance when you're editing. So let's get started. So number one quick tip is just go to Preferences and um, select Memory tab. And here under the RAM reserve for other application, I reduce the RAM for other applications. So Premiere Pro really work fast. So I'm just going to reduce uh, the RAM reserve for other applications. And RAM available for Premiere Pro is 13 GB and thus install RAM is 16 GB and hit OK. Another second tip is uh, go to project setting, file, project setting, general tab. And uh, under the general tab, you will select the Mercury Playback GPU Acceleration Metal recommended on Mac and uh, CUDA on uh, Windows or any other graphic card or install on your Windows. So it will really additional boost your rendering performance. So hit OK. Number third tip is your set your playback resolution to half or quarter. So if you are working on big projects, so you will uh, reduce the playback resolution from here go to project uh, pan program monitor panel and here you will reduce the resolution or just select the, this wrench icon and uh, here you playback resolution half or post resolution also half so it will really uh, boost your uh, performance or increase the uh, performance of your playback Another quick tip to improve the performance of Premiere Pro when you are editing. So here you will see I open uh, switch to color workspace and here you will see I open the Lumetri scope. So close this Lumetri scopes and uh, close this uh, thumbnail view. So, so switch to list view and also if you are using some effects. So here you will see in the program monitor the global effects mute button. So you just select this button on this button you can add this button just simply uh, button editor and just drag and drop this button uh, global effects button to your program monitor another quick tip is to delete the media cache files so go to preferences and uh, media cache files and here delete all media cache files and automatically delete cache files in 12 or 2 10 days and hit ok and close Premiere Pro and uh, go to library and uh, here you will find under the library tab you will find application support Adobe and here you will find common common media cache files and here you select tool and delete media cache files select tool move to trash select peak files and uh, delete it move to trash ptx files command a select all and move to trash if you like this video don't forget to like subscribe and share my videos thanks for watching digital creations